in this pot I have three strawberry plants that have been in the pot for quite a long time. I don't know if they're gonna survive or not, but we're gonna give them a try. Um, I had ordered those and had ordered them before we moved out to the property. Um, and they were all set to ship, but then our area had a lot of freezes. So the shipment was delayed. They ended up shipping right whenever we were moving. So we couldn't get them in the ground. Um, and then in this pot, we have some old asparagus crowns that are three, maybe four years old now, um, that we basically just dug out of the ground in hopes that we could get them planted at the new property. Um, so we're just gonna see if these take. We do have some more strawberries as well as some more two-year asparagus crowns that should be shipping over to us maybe in a week or so, just depending on if the freezes hold off a little bit longer. So um, we're in the mountains of North Carolina, so zone 6B. So we're still getting some freezing and below temperatures once a week or so. Um, so just to be safe, we have more asparagus crowns coming that are two year asparagus crowns and then some actual strawberry plants that are coming as well. We'll have those in a couple of weeks. We're gonna put these in the same bed, but we're gonna put these in this bed just to see if, you know, if they'll take. If they don't, we have plenty coming. And if they do, just more that we get to bring to the homestead. All right, so we are going to try to get some stuff planted in this bed. So this is a bed that Keith built me onto the side of the hillside. So we're planning on putting some asparagus and strawberries. It's kind of hard to tell on camera, but this is a pretty steep hill going up. And our camper is up, up here. And our hot tub and our shed. Um, and then you can kind of scroll down or burn pile. So there's our gate and our driveway goes up. This is all slanted here. Um, so we're gonna be doing mostly raised beds for the first couple of years till we can get the soil amended, try to build some good soil here. Um, this is all rocky clay, pretty much, as you can tell. So that's where the house pad is gonna be where the house pad, the basement's already been dug out up there. So that's where that clay is from. So we've got our fruit trees here. Just got some bags, mulch and stuff for them. More plants waiting to be potted, bulbs and stuff. And then here's the office, just to kind of give you a heads up on where we're at. Um, can tell here the bed itself is slanted and these are cedar um, boards
So today is April 14th and we've got quite a bit of new growth on our strawberries. You can see the bright red and all the new green leafy growth. They have loved this rain we're getting. And we also have some little asparagus tips coming up. There's one there. And then another one right here. And it looks like there might be something going to poke up right there. Lots of new growth in our strawberry and asparagus bed.